How does a scramjet engine work? Have you ever wondered how we can travel faster than sound and even reach the edge of space? One of the fascinating technologies helping us achieve this is the scramjet engine. So, how does it actually work? A scramjet engine, which stands for supersonic combustion ramjet, is designed for hypersonic flight, meaning it operates at speeds greater than five times the speed of sound. Unlike traditional jet engines, scramjets do not have rotating parts like compressors or turbines. Instead, they use the aircraft's high speed to compress incoming air. When an aircraft reaches hypersonic speeds, air enters the engine through a specially shaped inlet. This inlet slows the air down slightly while increasing its pressure and temperature. The process happens naturally due to the aircraft's forward motion, without any mechanical components involved. Once the air is compressed, it flows into the combustor where fuel, usually hydrogen, is injected. Here, combustion occurs while the airflow remains supersonic. This requires precise mixing of fuel and air and careful timing for ignition. The design allows the engine to avoid excessive pressure buildup, making it efficient at extreme speeds. As the combustion takes place, the heated, high-pressure gas expands through a diverging nozzle. This expansion accelerates the gas to hypersonic velocities, generating thrust that propels the aircraft forward. The nozzle is designed to convert thermal energy into kinetic energy effectively. Several key physics principles are at play in a scramjet engine. Ram pressure from the aircraft's speed compresses the air, eliminating the need for mechanical compressors. Thermodynamics plays a role as well, as managing shock waves and heat releases is essential to prevent thermal choking. Additionally, fluid dynamics is crucial, as the inlet shapes must be optimized to minimize drag and maximize pressure recovery. Scramjets have exciting applications in space propulsion. They are ideal for vehicles aiming to access space due to their efficiency at high speeds in the upper atmosphere. By using atmospheric oxygen for combustion, they could reduce the need for rocket oxidizers, which can lower launch costs. However, scramjets cannot operate in low oxygen environments, so hybrid systems, like combining rockets and scramjets, are often necessary for reaching orbit. Despite their potential, scramjets face several challenges. One major issue is ignition stability. Keeping combustion going in a supersonic flow requires advanced mixing techniques. Thermal management is another challenge, as the extreme heat generated necessitates cooling systems, often using the fuel itself. Finally, practical operation is currently limited to speeds between 5 and 15 times the speed of sound due to material and aerodynamic constraints. The scramjet engine represents a fascinating intersection of physics and engineering, paving the way for rapid atmospheric travel and cost-effective missions into near space. With ongoing research and development, we may soon see scramjets play a significant role in our journey beyond Earth.